Hey everybody, thanks so much for taking part in the Beauty Bash this week. I hope you enjoyed yourself. I hope you learned something new about taking care of your skin or perhaps doing your makeup. My goal is always to just um, give you more information so that you can do your beauty routine with more confidence and in turn get more confidence in every day. So it is my joy to be able to help you and I hope that, uh, that I was able to communicate that this week. So uh, this last video is about the Mary Kay opportunity. Um, and if you're watching this, you are going to have an opportunity to get some samples and you're gonna comment that at the end. I'm gonna give you a little um, password and you are going to give that to me and then I'm gonna know you watch this and then you are gonna get some samples and I have many to choose from. Charcoal mask, um, moisture noon gel mask, microderm abrasion. So um, those are gonna be really fun. But I'm going to tell you a little bit more about how I got started with Mary Kay and I'm going to tell you why people start a business and um, and then how you could start if it was something that you want to do. So I've actually used Mary Kay since I was 16, um, but I've been doing this for 12 years and I started by just doing a little bit and and then circumstances changed in my life and I ended up doing more. My background is actually in purchasing and in inventory management. I was with an agricultural company. So I don't have a sales background, I don't have a makeup background. I've just learned things as I've gone and I've had so much fun doing it and connecting with women. So I really do love my job. Um, and the great thing about this is that you can do a little or you can do a lot and it's entirely up to you because we have no sales quotas in Mary Kay. So you get to decide what it is that you want to do and how much you want to do. So that's um, a little bit different than some direct sales companies. But I think there's three reasons why women start a business um, with Mary Kay. The first one, of course, is money. Um, in Mary Kay, we have the highest commissions in any direct selling company in North America. And so that means that they treat us really well. And um, I'm so appreciative of that. But what's really makes Mary Kay different is that we have a consumable product. So if I buy this, I love direct sales and I buy from many companies, but if I buy this um, cardigan, um, once I have it, I have it. I don't really need to get a new one until it's ripped or it's looking old and that might be a year or maybe two, whatever it might be. Well, with Mary Kay, we have a consumable product. So hopefully our customers fall in love with it but then they use it up and then they need to purchase it again. And so that's what we call consumable. And so when they purchase a product again and again, that gives us what we call residual income. So residual income is really powerful because what that means is that when I'm uh, grocery shopping or when I'm working in my yard or when I take my kids to the zoo, I can get orders coming in from customers saying, hey, I need one of these, I need one of these, one of these, and that is residual income. I'm not working at that time, but I'm making an income. And so that's the really cool thing that I love about Mary Kay so much. And after 12 years, you get a lot of that. So that's fun. The second reason people start a Mary Kay business is really not to start a business at all. It's because they want the discount. So when you sign up, you get to buy at cost, okay? Which will save you a lot of money if you love our products and um, you use a lot of them. And so when you sign up, you get to buy at that price. And um, so I have a lot of people that we call personal use consultants. They buy it for themselves, maybe for some family or friends, and uh, they buy Christmas gifts and that sort of thing, but they don't really sell. Um, and that's okay. They just buy, they just sign up for the discount and that's great too. I actually started that way. So, so that's the second reason why people start. Um, the third reason is for flexibility because you can work this business around whatever, whatever you need to. So I started off, I had no kids. Um, I was just a farm, just a farmer's wife. Um, uh, and now I have two kids. So when they were young, I used to not work during the day. I would work in the evenings, either when they were sleeping or when my husband came home and he would give me a break and I would work during that time. Now I almost only work during the day and I don't work at night um, so that I'm at home with the girls. And so you can work this around other jobs and your family situation. Um, Mary Kay always says faith first, family second, and career third. So you have the flexibility to do that. Other reasons why women start a business very quickly are leadership opportunities, tax advantages, prizes, and personal growth. I won't get into any of that. This is just a quick little video. So um, are you right for this? I don't know. Do you um, like helping people? Because that's kind of what I do. I share products I love and I help women find the products that they love. Do you need extra income? If you do, this might be right for you as well. So 
If any of this has struck a chord with you and you want to hear more information, please let me know and I will give you um, some more information about this. But I thank you for watching. Um, your keyword is pink Cadillac and you need to message me with that, with that um, word on Messenger. You say pink Cadillac and then I'm going to ask you what samples I can send you. And I thank you so much for watching this video. Have a great day, guys. Bye.